Hey. Ah, yes. I wish I could tell Chandler everything, but knowing the truth would only put him in more danger. Of course. Anyway, you have my thanks for helping him. Perhaps I can trust you after all. Right. I am Snorpington Fizzlebean, engineer and seeker of truths. Here, new chum, lean in close so that I may bestow a hug on you. Uh, ah. no, 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 I, uh, um, I don't, I don't want, uh... Ah, what an excellent hugging experience that was. No, it wasn't. We shall have to do that many more times. No, we don't. Now, I need your help. Are you willing to risk your life for the greater good? Sure, whatever. Splendid! There is another device you will need. I've hidden it inside the bug watch tower. I've already picked it up. It, I will tell you more. Ugh, one of those flying bug snacks has set off the tower's alarm system again. Although you seem to have avoided being trapped inside. Clever. All right, return to me for the next phase of the plan. Okay. Ah, chum, I have such a craving for quookies. Okay. Why, my craving is so terrible that I would like my teeth to be quookies, so oh. that I may taste my own teeth, you see. Uh, okay. Oh. Ooh. <laughs> Splendid. I no longer have to worry about psychotronic torture or cavities. But now I hunger for charm mallows. Can't ever have enough charm mallows. Uh, I'm supposed to catch a charm mallow. No, this this is the. The charm mallows give off an unusual. I believe they may be key to the Grumpanati surveillance system, though I'm not yet sure how. Their signal should be safely contained inside my stomach. Whoa, Snorp Dog, you got the radio working? Let's put some jams on! They're not now, Chandler. The radio is <clears throat> broken. Oh, there's another one. And then nail over there. I didn't notice that one. Right, but the question is how am I supposed to get this marshmallowy douchebag? Um. Let's sleep till five. It should be flying around by now, shouldn't we? Yeah. Oh, I've got no idea. Need to call it off. This might be a worth a chart. If I cook this in peanut butter.
Oh, it's lit. The snack is destroyed. Some water. Oh, I should. I don't, I don't have that. I've got an idea. What happens if I... Really nice. Of one, but just one. It did. That worked out better than I was expecting. Here you go. safely return to Snacksburg. Meet me outside. Okay. Hmm. This guy seems cleared of danger. I suppose it's now or never. Oh. Snorpy's ready to go? All right, dog. Let's do this. Let's go. Just a moment, Chandlo. You've been an invaluable ally. I'm even tempted to call you a friend, but quietly so I'm not overheard. Bro, if I didn't think it'd crush you like a tin can... I would hug the grump out of you. Oh, what yeah, you know hugs. Here it comes. No, why is it with hugs in this place? Stop hug hugging me. Is. You do that hug. No hug. All right, let's get out of here. Race you back to town, Snorp Dog. No, please don't make me run with you, Chandlo. I'll go weak in the knees. If you're not up for it, I could always carry you. No, no, that's quite all right. Your loss. See you back in Wait. town, bro. Chandlo. Right, so I've got Snorpy and Chandlo. I'm more freaked out, I saw some things just completely made out of. <sighs> What's up, bro? How much? Three taps, still bad. Here's the sleep. 
Everybody sleeping. As well, right, let's uh, put that and that. I'm going some search. Oh, sweet. I'm just happy that I can make friends with these things. What? Right. Oh, oh, not again. Ah, oh, not again! I should tie myself down. <laughs> well, let's just sleep until noon. Everything's done. Hi, how you doing, Harley? Just enjoying this. It's a weird game, but it's a weirdly interesting game. How you doing? I'm doing well, thank you for asking. I'm gonna steal your chocolate. Hey, buddy. Hey. Um, oh, there he is. Hey. How's it going? Oh, they're all so cute. Thank you so much. <laughs> Hopefully, my little ones will settle down. Yeah. Maybe I can even start training them again. Wait, what? These catch just cheap. I might be able to catch them now because I've got the thingy. Oh, hello, science. Oh, hello. Hello, I gave you a marshmallow for a nose. I forgot about that. Are you mad? I can't have my secrets plastered all over the front page news. Yeah. Hmm. I suppose I can reveal a tad bit so long as my identity is protected. Let's do this then. Interview time. So, who are you? <clears throat> I am Snorp Redacted. <laughs> I have devoted my life to inventing devices that foil the machinations of the Grumpinati. Okay. And um, why did you come to Snack Tooth Island? Well, I was dragged here by my dearest friend, Chan Redacted. He thought I needed some fresh air or something. As much as I hate the outdoors, I simply can't say no to him. That's fair enough. And how long have you and Redacted been in a relationship? Well, I, 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 I mean, we've been together since kindergarten. It would make perfect sense if we were together together. He's never said we are, has he? And your thoughts on book snacks? I surmise they are some sort of synthetic life form designed to beguile our taste buds. Um, if book snacks are artificial, where did they come from? I'm so glad you asked. I believe there may be a factory located on this very island, hidden somewhere deep underground. I have charts. Let me show you my charts later. Okay, that's fair enough. Um, why did you leave the town? I was too exposed. Flufty tried to wrap me up in that experiment. Now that Lizbert and Agabel weren't around to occupy That's them, who that person is. I could see that this was the next step in the Grumpinati's plot against me. Grumpinati plot. Lizbert disappears. We are hit with an earthquake. We suffer a snack shortage. All that in one day. Do you really think those are all coincidences? The timeline is on my charts. Uh, any info on Liz? Elizabeth Megafig was a curious sort and had a foolish bone in her body. She could rival me in wits and chat redacted. Blow an arm wrestling. We would share secrets now. <laughs> Sorry, this is the redacted thing's getting to me. Terrible secrets. <laughs> oh, what terrible secrets. <laughs> I'm not telling you the terrible secrets because they are terrible and secret. That is fair enough. Yeah, I think we're done here. Excellent interrogation, chum. So great that you deserve another N no, hugging experience. No, we, we do not. We do not need to know. Stop with the hugs. Oh. <laughs> uh, this must not go on the record. Elizabeth Megafig discovered something on the island that came to me for help. Hmm? An entrance to the underground locked behind a strange device. I assisted her in unraveling its secrets, and soon after, she vanished. Oh. You must take extreme caution. I can tell you where to find it, but the rest is up to you. Thank you.
Near Mountain Peak. Uh, hang left from the trail and take a narrow ledge north. Where is that? Oh, I don't think we've been there yet. Um, have I been there yet? No. Hmm. Right. Um. Oh, hey. Well met. Thank you. Where is he? Is he up here? Nope. Oh, there he is. That's who I was looking for. What's up? What's up? Ooh, gonna quiz me, dog? Yeah. I'll crush your questions. Let's do this. Got the interview. Right. <laughs> Done. Who are you? Chandlo Funkbun. I lift. Awesome. Uh, lifting is a job. It's a way of life, bro. Anything that needs to go up. Logs, buildings, balls, Snorpy, I'll get them there. Okay, fair enough. So why did you come to Snack Tooth Island? I want to push my limits. <clears throat> I gotta go somewhere extreme. I heard nobody comes back from this island. Sounds like a challenge oh, that's, to me. That's not, that's not a challenge. That's uh, fine for you, but what about Snoopy? Snoopy. Hey, I'm always looking out for Snorpy. I know roughing it isn't his style, but there's no way I was coming here without him. How did you two become a thing? I don't know what you mean, dog. We're like the sky and the sea. We've been together since the dawn of time. So, um, what is your thoughts on bug snacks? Bug snacks are strong. Like a primal kind of strong. Like they own this place. And I gotta respect that. So why did you leave town? Bro, Snacksburg was a disaster without Lisburg. Have you? Um, I couldn't stop all the fighting with lifting or I don't wisdom. know what game it is. I'm gonna be I honest. Gotta keep things chill for Snorpy. He's got a lot but, of that. I mean, Social it's anxiety. with this. It's the consoles just come out here in the UK as well, which is nice. Um, so far, I've so uh, I've only played two games on the console this and um the astro playroom thing and both of them have been really really good i mean this has been strange which i expected it from it's, it's from the guys who made octodad so i expect it to be weird anyway um but the astro playroom as well for a game that's just showing you how the controller works it's really really good which i i'm surprised with um, we have got both my Xbox and the PlayStation right next to each other. And, uh, I think the one thing that really sh surprised me is how much bigger the PlayStation is compared to the Xbox. <laughs> it is, it is weird. It is really weird. Um, anyway, yes, uh, any info on this, but... Lizbert is top dog, you feel me? She really inspires me to test my limits. That's cool. But, uh, that's about it. I'm really tighter with Agabelle. Okay. Alright, um, what can you tell me about Agabelle? Agabelle's a sweetie. She was always looking out for me. Showed me how to stay safe while still pushing my limits. But she was always pushing herself way harder. Thank you. Um, she was working out? Yeah, she asked me to train her. Surprised the grump out of me, because she really wasn't built for that kind of stuff. We'd go running every morning. And lifting after lunch. Though she would get real down on herself sometimes. But she never gave up. And I respect that. Which is good. So uh, what happened to Lisbeth and Agbel? I wish I could tell you. Those two were strong together. I can't think of anything that could take them down. They gotta be okay out there. Somewhere. Mm -hmm. Thanks, Chenlo, man. That's Bro, good that's interview. not... Just... Anyway, I recorded Agabelle's progress while we were working out. Okay. She shared some pretty private stuff. 
but maybe it'll help you bring her back to us. Don't let me down, bro. I won't, promise. Oh, I know where that is. What's going on, Wiggle? Hey there. How's it going? Everything's going fine. I'm happy that the place is starting to get busy. Um, this is a chest. Maybe. Number three. Let's have a look at these. Anyway, um, so two we saw. See where this is going. She loves you. You two will be back to normal in no time. But I don't want to go back to normal. I don't want her worrying about me anymore. <laughs> when you love somebody, you never stop worrying about them. I know. And I'm worried about her too. I just want to take better care of her. And that starts with me. Yeah. Okay. Sydney, hello. Right, let's... Okay, let her fly, and I'll show you my incredible aim. Just try not to hit Bilbo again. I need some more food. That is floof D. Turning into snacks. Bug snacks and we're all fine. So why are you getting on my case? I'm just worried, Bill. You're not acting like yourself. You mean I'm not miserable. I found a way to make myself useful and happy to finally take some control over my life. And you're just upset because it doesn't involve you. I'm not upset. You don't need me. Anymore. Although the fighting. Ooh. <gasps> it was flifty all along. But I need to go and I know now I've got these tools. Can I get the easy puff things? Important, can I get him? No, no, the last thing I want to do is... I can't put this down. Okay. Oh no. That's bad, that's bad, that's bad, that's bad, that's bad. Oh no, 
no, no, no, no, don't start. Let's try on here. If that worked or not, <laughs> okay. I've been stupid. I've got to be. Use the launch pad and launch your snack trap. Up. Oh! Thank you. Uh, where's the launch pad gone? Flip sec, I could have moved this. I'm I'm in a bad mood now. They're gone for the night, aren't they? <laughs> I was trying to I was trying to get these earlier and um, one I didn't I kept on trying to throw rocks at them <laughs> if I put my snack up on there and then nope uh Until it comes back, and I'll try and catch it. Oh, shoot! Oh, so close. I have to activate it in mid air. What if I try and catch it while I'm? Could be interesting. I'm gonna try this way one more time. Got it! Oh! Uh, angry potato! <laughs> Double angry potatoes! Oh shoot, he is. No way. Oh, 
Stop following me. Is he still following me? I'm gonna launch. I'm gonna launch this. Where'd he go? You know what? I'm gonna see what happens if I do this. Oi! Come on! <laughs> Oh, it didn't work! It didn't work! It didn't work! I was... It didn't launch the bunga! It didn't like it! Oh no! I'm gonna launch you into that this time! Come on! I think I've trapped him. I have. <laughs> He's trapped. Oh no, I've stuck the bunga. Oh, that was worth it. <laughs> right, anyway. Our plan is to go and grab this thing. Gotcha. Oh man. It's <clears throat> one more to go. No, oh, well, I'm going to put it here. See yeah, how this works. Oh. All three. That went that went a lot easier. Um now let's go feed this guy. Just really call cool, that back as well, shouldn't I? You happy now? Oi, you Right, um... And one more. I'm gonna slowly turn you into cheese. Okay, okay. I know you're just itching to get your paws on that bridge. So, I'll cut you a deal, friend. I want a fryer, but it's on this ridiculously tall rock. And it wasn't exactly blessed with stilts for legs. <laughs> Wait, you mean that fighter over there? I could get that fighter. I now have made him a nice fighter. I could really do with just chicken. He loves ketchup. He loves a lot of things. Here's a, here's a fryer. I actually had jumped over there. Oh, shoot. Oh no. What's with you and your anger issues? God's sake, go away. Why did I go around this way? Uh, that was worth a shot. I would like to say... I can hear the potato getting angry. Right. 
I just realized, even if I, what's it called? Shh. Shit. You know, I'm going to do something stupid. And it's going to work. You'll see. Oh, no, 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 no. The wind. How this goes. It's either going to work really, really well, or it's not. And launch. Gotcha. I got sweet prizes. Hmm. Yeah, the bloody potato in the background. Wait, did they just both stun themselves? Oh, of course, buddy. What happens? I just turn around and there's a. Alright, all you want is. Okay, yeah, have that. Um, I will turn your hand into a fry. Pleasure doing business with you. Hey, you're my best and only customer. Yep. I'm starting to think I should get a better location back in Snacksburg. But uh, moving all this inventory across the desert is real sweaty work. I'll need a way to keep cool. If you make both my feet into big bops, I just put one in a thing. Hot sands would be a breeze. But I gotta warn you, you won't find bopsicles. I know where to find them. Better look elsewhere, pal. <laughs> Right, let's go and get some popsicles. I know how to get them quite easily as well. I knew when I handed that one in, I knew I would need one. Hey, buddy. Hey. So, to get a bo a big popsicle, I don't think they're, oh they are, awesome, might work out better than I think, than I thought, right so if I do this, and then of course, come on, Come on, chase me, chase me. Oh. What the hell? What? What? Oh yeah, I turned his nose into a kiwi. I forgot about that. <laughs> Popsicle, 
He's gonna blow up into a thing again, isn't he? And... No, why not? We'll sleep again. bees follow me well, I was hoping you would run into that tree Oh no, he's gonna explode. Nope, didn't want that. And enough tiny bobsicles. Tip to five. I like to point out earlier I saw something creepy. I did that. Um, I wonder which one I'm going to get rid of. Yes. I have a bunch of bees. Oh. No, it says Big Bobsicle, doesn't it? Yeah, it says Big. We need the big ones. Nothing like a campfire. I would not change your nose. <laughs> nice night out. It definitely does say big ones. <laughs> My favorite burger. Right. <laughs> ah, yeah, 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 yeah. Sweet relief. These things better not melt off. Anyway, a deal's a deal, friend. The bridge is yours. Some assembly required. What? Oh, what, what, what do you mean? Oh, and so you know. Crumdomod is not responsible for any loss or injury suffered as a result of the use of its products. Hey, oh. If you need anything else, anything at all, please, please, please call your friend Crumdo. Oh, I'm already sweating. It's too hot. It's too hot. Oh, I don't want to. Big. <sighs> Might as well just head back for now.
He left me a broken bridge. I'm not happy. Let's go find him. He owes me a bridge. Need volcano. Let's just uh Befica. To what do I owe the honor? Oh, oh, I'm just curious what you think you're doing here. What am I doing? I'm working the counter. Cromdomart's back in business, baby. Don't He's selling logs. If you start running scams again, I'll know. Yeah, yeah, because you know everything. And here's what I know. You're not better than me, Beth. Nobody likes all you snooping around. <laughs> I don't care what they think about me, as long as I make sure you get what you deserve. Don't I always? Are you going to buy something or what? Yeah, I'll take a tall snack water extra fizz. Coming right up. Oh. Ah, nothing like getting toasted. Right. We'll give him a spuddy. A bopsy comb. Go on, Charwe. Just follow Papa's pointer. Or or don't. That's fine too. Mm -hmm. Uh how's trying? To a bit of a slow start. We need volcano. It went so easy with Sprout, I just don't know what's going wrong now. Maybe. Maybe Sprout can help. I'm sure he can show Charwe the ropes. What do you say? Uh, maybe later. Everyone gone to bed? Yeah. Oh. Uh. Bobo wants to speak to me. It's sleepy time in the place that everyone's asleep. The noise. Oh. Oh, come on. What did I do? Just wandering around. A wiggle, 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 wiggle. Want something? Yes. I want an All interview. Right, I could use some practice. They'll be interviewing me every day when I'm a gazillionaire. <laughs> I real some of money. So, who are you? Business King, Sales Savant, future CEO of Starbucks, the one, the only, Crando Face. And why did you come to Snack Tooth Island? You ever smell the future, kid? Huh? I can tell you, Lisbeth stank of opportunity. She came on TV talking big about this new superfood, and I wanted in. So I quit my dead-end job and followed that stench of possibility. So, what was your dead-end job? Yeah, I used to go door-to-door -door selling gruel to grandmas. Paid on commission, for crumbs sake. And your thoughts on the book snacks? What do I think of? Delicious! Irresistible! Marketable! They're gonna catapult me straight to the top of Money Town, baby! And uh, why did you leave town? Yeah, I tried to make use of what Lisbeth didn't need anymore, and Befica didn't like that! Yeah, she went and told everyone that I'm a thief! Where are you standing? I was salvaging! That's a community service, pal! But Bethika <laughs> planted evidence in my hut, said I stole her diary. So I did what any honest grump would do. I ran. That is not honest. So any info on this? Dude, don't get me started. Everyone here thinks she's so great, such a fantastic leader. But I know the truth. She came here to stroke her ego and get Egabel her fix. 
The rest of us were just pss, disposable. Disposable? That's pretty cold. That's Elizabeth mega thick. When push came to shove, she abandoned us. What do you mean? I, I gotta confess, I was thinking about sailing home after things got hairy. But when I went looking for our boat, it was gone. There's only two grumps missing. You do the math. <laughs> I bet Liz and Egg are living large in New Grump City by now. Oh, calm down, come uh from the Not for now. Thank you. Yeah, 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 yeah. I get it, pal. I'm not the nicest grumpus around. I learned early on that life is like a box of trash. You always know what you're gonna get. Trash. Trash. Just go check out where the boat was. See what you think of Lisburn after that. Okay. So we've got another map. End of Boiling Bay. That's the shipwreck. Liz was definitely over there, you'll see. We've been to Boiling Bay? I don't think we have yet, have we? And Boiling Bay is at the bottom, isn't it? Just the volcano is on the left hand side. Where am I? Oh, I'm next to my boat. Where are you, Phil Bum? There he is. Hey. Hi there. Um, uh, right. You're doing a great job, buddy. But hey, don't forget to take care of yourself. In fact, maybe you should turn in early today hmm. and just relax. Uh, you know what? Why not? We're having a break. <sighs> oh, bloody hell! What's going on? Huh. Something's wrong, buddy. We better take a look. I feel like I'm the cause of this. Going on. Africa, Gramble, what happened? We saw something real spooky walk right into town. I thought it was a grumpus at first, but like something about it was. Oh, don't tell me it's that thing I saw earlier. Was this creature wearing a crown by any chance? Or was it perhaps holding some sort of ceremonial dagger? What? No. no. Nothing like that. It was it made of kind of normal snacks. Until it, oh, until it. It turned into a bunch of bug snacks and like scattered. Frankly, I find that hard to swallow. Dad, what a load, Ben. I, I... Drama around town for you lately, huh? Zonk off, Cromdo. Unlike you, I don't lie for a living. Oh, wow. So tell me then, what were you doing skulking around at midnight? Breaking into huts? Again? I seen it too. And this time I know it's not just one of my nightmares. Get some grump and sleep, Gramble. I can't. Not with all of y'all around here with your hungry mouths. Don't take this the wrong way, darling, but you are a bit high strung. A little beauty sleep would do you wonders. Maybe then you'd finally let us eat a few pets. You say that again. Oh, oh no. Oh, oh, great. No, no, this, this is weird when the fighting like this. Chill the out, bros. There's no need for all that. If what Gramble and Befica are saying is true, there's got to be some physical evidence left behind. Yeah? Um, we should sweep the oh. perimeter and keep watch in case the creature returns. Um, uh, good idea. Uh, buddy, do you think you can scope out the restroom? You know, find out what they saw? <laughs> Why is it always me? Nothing good comes from me. Why is this all spot? Whoa, why is this all spot? Hmm. 
Those clues over there. I'm not becoming a spa. Oh, there's another sign. Oh, it's like snacks. The lock's broken. Hmm. It was you! I'd never trust a kiwi. <laughs> the fruit. Uh, not, 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 uh, not the bird. The bird's cool. Alright, there's one more clue somewhere. Where? Seriously, where is the last clue? Not up here, is it? Nope. That was me guessing. Who's at the back of the house? So, so scared. I just wish I could rest easy for once. My heart's pounding like crazy. You believe me, don't you, Bestie? It's surprising I do believe you guys because we've seen it. <laughs> this whole mess is a waste of time. I bet Gramble just had a bad dream and he spooked Befica while he was at it. Is that last clue? Hey, uh, buddy. Sorry, I can't stand it when everybody fights. I hope this is over soon. I do too, but I can't find where the last clue is. Oh, no more bug snacks. Why did I not notice that? You found what you were looking for? All right, I'll call everybody together. Yeah, let's do this. Well, w w what did you find? This well, trucks. That's. Um, I reckon there's got to be some other explanation. Cram it, Wampo. We got a genuine monster on our paws. Hmm. Monster's a bit of a prejudicial term, don't you think? I'd call it more of a cryptid or undiscovered animal. It's no animal, darling. We're witnessing the queen of bug snacks in action. She's given us a one. Oh, that is absurd. Which is more likely, that a so far unseen giant bug snack politely left a note on our door, or that this is some form of coordinated gaslighting by the Grump and our What's more likely, dear, is that you've watched far too many movies. Yep. But at least my theory has scientific data behind it, whereas you haven't even drawn one chart. <gasps> I was top of the charts. No, Thank that's you. not what you... Whoa, 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 whoa. You know what? Let's split the difference, eh? You're both wrong. Oh, what does it even matter? Whatever it is, it wants us dead. Between this and the earthquakes, Snacksburg's becoming pretty unlivable. I hate to say it, bro, 
but I regret coming down from the mountain. Me and Snorpy were a lot safer before we came back. No, no, no. Same goes for me and my little ones. No, no, no. We shouldn't split up again. We're better off if we're all here together. That might have been true when Lisbert was around, but those days are long gone. Y you don't know that. She might come back. Yeah, don't hold your breath, pal. Face it, Bilbo. Without Lisbert, all we have is you. That's, That's mean. That's not true. Hey, go me. I don't know why Lisbert put me in charge, but I do know this. None of you were really happy out there alone. We don't have Lisbert, but we have each other. Maybe if we try, we could all add up to one of her. <sighs> I guess you're not wrong. Mm. Oh, we're all staying in town then? Seems like it. As long as we can watch each other's backs. If we're gonna make it, we need everybody here. Floofty and Sheldar are still out there, and, and who knows if they're safe. If you must find Floofty, according to the tracking device I placed on them, they're out by Boiling Bay. Why have you put Last a truck in? I saw Shelda, she was meditating in the sizzling sands. But don't forget about Egabel. If she's not with Lisbert, we gotta find her. We will, Chandlo. And once we do, we'll throw a big welcome back party. How does that sound? Okay. Great! Now, let's go get some sleep. <sighs> hey, Chandlo. What's up, bro? How's it going? Uh, I like how they've cleared the sign quite quickly as well. <laughs> Um, yeah, I'm gonna hate to say this, but I feel like this might be a good point to call it quits for now. As I'm gonna be honest, I do need to get some sleep, but we will definitely be back to finish off bug snacks. I mean, I think we've got we've got all the bugs we need to find as well. Um, but we've got all this stuff. But uh, if I'm flufty. Yoda and Agabel and Liz still gone missing. The one that likes to meditate. Scientist and the one that's on top of the mountain. The five to six hour game. It's a short game, I know. It's it's nice. Um, but it's like, it's, it's 1.30 in the morning here. <laughs> and I'm going to be honest, I've been up quite early because I was hoping my console came a little bit earlier. <laughs> oh, but um, I know I'm, I'm happy to finish this. I really am. A short game, but it's a really good game. And sometimes that's what you really need from this. But, um, of course, if you enjoyed this... Please like, comment, subscribe to us here at Crave Your Game. I will be back. I'll be back tomorrow with some more uh, video. What we're we doing? Probably doing some of this in the afternoon. And probably, I think we have got um, Golf of Friends or something like that. I think they're planning on Friday. No, I'm not sure yet. We need to have, I'll have a look into that. But, um,. Until then, thank you for joining me, and um, I will see you next time. Good night, everybody. Hi, Wambus. Sleepy time. My fade thing didn't work. Oh, oh well.